Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 7 tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about a stub customization. The PHP artisan make commands are used to create a variety of classes such as controllers, models, migrations, and job. These classes are generated using a stub files that are populated with values based on your input. However, you may sometimes wish to make some changes to files generated by artisan uh, to accomplish this laravel 7 provides the a stub publish command okay so let's run the stub publish command so go to the command prompt and here just type php artisan a stub colon publish okay just press enter the stubs published successfully so the published stub will be uh, located within a, a stubs directory okay so go to the project and inside the root directory you can see here the stub folder okay so just open it and you can see all the stubs like here controller stubs job stub job dot queued stub okay and migration stubs model and test stub okay let's uh, open a new one stub let uh, so let's open uh, controller controller dot plain dot stub file okay all right Inside this file, you can see there are some default codes are written here. Okay. Whenever we create any new controller, these default codes are written in that controller. Now, I am going to uh, create a new controller to show you. So, switch to the command prompt and uh, here just type php artisan make colon controller and controller name let's say controller name is a student controller okay now controller is created so go to the project and inside the app folder http then controllers and here is a student controller so just open it and you can see here inside the student controller uh, <coughs> these are code uh, which are coming from the <coughs> coming from the controller dot plane dot stuff file okay all right now make some change in changes inside the stuff file so go to the controller dot plane dot stub file so just go to the stubs folder and just click on controller dot plane dot stub file all right and here i am just going to create a function so just type here public function and function name let's say function name is create okay curly bracket is standard close and all right this is the blank function uh, which name is create okay now create another new controller and see the changes inside the controller so go to the command prompt and here just type php artisan make controller and controller name let's say this time controller name is student new controller okay now press enter all right controller created now go to the project and uh, inside the controllers folder this is the student new controller just open it okay you can see the differences 
here is the new default controller code which is written there okay so in this way you can customize any of these stubs so that's all about the stub customization in laravel 7 so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching